Bells and Wilkins has released new speakers. This time, this is their brand new 800 Diamond Series lineup. It is the continuation of their original 800 series. So this is their D4 800 series lineup. And in this lineup, you have a stand mount speaker. Then you have four tower speakers, as well as two center channel speakers. So it all uh, depends on what you are looking for. Um, let's take a look at what you can expect here. Uh, the first is the is the stand mount bookshelf speaker that is the 805 d4 um i will get to the price because all these speakers are high end they are very expensive you have to pay to get them the four tower speakers they release is the 804 d4 the cheapest 803 d4 802 d4 and um, the final one, which is the flagship, is the 801 D4. That's pretty much uh, top of the line here. Now, what are we looking at here? Based on the the driver you're getting this time around, it's a continuing cone used uh, for its um, mid-range and mid um, um, and mid base, basically, uh, which which existed in this previous model is returning on this new model um the the cabinet is well made so you are going to have a very rigid and strong cabinet this time around in terms of uh, looks still looks like the older 800 it's not it's not anything unique in terms of look because they're still kind of like keeping their old look, basically. Um, I would have wanted them to uh, maybe modernize the look a bit, maybe add a different flavor to this look. Uh, but they they decided to retain the older look. Now, um, the other stuff they released is the center speakers. They released two center speakers. Um, the HTM 81D4, HTM 82D4. Uh, it, it's it's going to be very good, basically. You, you can buy this for your home theater setup. The only thing missing here is an Atmos uh, speaker, which I don't think Bounds and Wilkins are more or less interested in making because that's not really their thing. Uh, they are more or less into... Um, top of the line high fidelity speakers just don't care so much about uh, surrounds and all that atmos people want basically and uh, some other manufacturers or many other manufacturers tend to to produce so you're not getting it here uh, for right now so that's uh, that's okay now, basically, in terms of pricing, these things are not cheap. They are well made, but they are not cheap. So, if you have the money for it, we'll start out with the flagship, the the the, the 801 D4. That one is going to be priced at thirty five thousand dollars. The 802 D4 floor standing speaker will be priced at twenty six thousand dollars. The 803 D4 priced at um, twenty thousand uh, dollars. The 804 D4 will be priced at twelve thousand five hundred dollars. These are for the tower speakers. Now, as for uh, sender speakers, um, as for sender speakers, you'll be looking at uh, you'll be looking at um, the HTM 81 D4 will be go for seven thousand five hundred dollars while the htm 82 would uh, go for five thousand five hundred the other one uh the other one which is the bookshelf uh, the bookshelf stand mount speaker the 805 d4 will be priced at eight thousand dollars so these are not cheap uh these are not cheap 
speakers by any means so uh they will be available in september um, what i will do is that if you're someone that really likes specs you want to see specs you're interested you want to know much that, uh, about the internal speaker design of this models that was released i will leave that in the description so you can go check that out so if you are interested in picking this up uh, that will start happening from next month that's if you have the cash to get it so do subscribe to the channel smash the like button i'll see everyone next time